All right, Shalom. I'd like to start off by giving all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh by Shimi Haushai, double honors to the elders and apostles of GMS Double Well, and peace and blessings to the hopeful elect. And, um, you know, uh, this video will be, uh, you know, entitled Watch Out for Agents, you know, because, um, you know, here in the latter days, you know, you're going to have a lot of, you know, uh, people set up by these so called white people, these Edomites, you know, to infiltrate um infiltrate uh different camps and um you know just so esau could uh you know uh, demonize them in the lord you know send an agent agent among, amongst the camps you know have them do some some bug out shit and then just uh blame it on all of us you know many great millstone but you know blame all the israelite camps you know period you know because uh to people in the world you know, when they hear about, you know, Esau, you know, he wants to control the narrative. So when whenever he he speaks about us, he always label us black Hebrew Israelites, you know. So, you know, the word black itself, you know, has a, a vibration to it, you know. And uh, that's Esau's witchcraft, the so-called white man's witchcraft. You know, he puts, uh, uh, he changes the uh, uh, meanings, mean uh, word definitions and, um, you know, and then put different vibrations on, on different words, you know. So when people hear it automatically, it triggers some, uh, you know, a, um, uh, inbred reaction that Esau put put in them, you know. That, uh, you know, uh, that uh, what's it called? Um, how do you say it? You know, basically a sheep reaction, you know, because these people are stupid anyways. You know, they just accept everything that Esau tell them. You know, they just gobble it up, you know, and don't even do the research for themselves. You know, not knowing that amongst our camps, you know, we have so-called Latino, Native American brothers and confusion of faith, faces in, in great millstone camps, you know, brothers that look like all different nations, you know. But, um, um yeah, you're going to have, you know, agents infiltrating camps, you know. So this guy right here, you know, I'm going to go into it. This guy, this channel is GMS Augusta Elect Men, right? Go to this guy page, right? You see this guy? You see his face, right? Okay, you see who this guy is, right? So now this video is the last video that he posted. Now you go to the date. It was posted on April 20, 28th. Well, I got my, my, you know, this is French, but um, this is April 28th, 2018, right? So that was basically about three months ago. So now... Um, you go right here. This is my history right here, you know, because um, I did, you know, some research on this guy because, um, you know, last night, yesterday, um, you know, I basically Googled, you know, black Hebrew Israelites and, you know, how you filter it with the date that they were posted. And then uh, the video that popped up was um this one. That's the video. All that right, That's the first video I've seen of this guy. Right. So th that's a different channel that he has called Men of the Lord. Oh shit! I didn't even I subscribed by accident. Let me unsubscribe to that nigga. But um, yeah, he posted on um on uh August second. This is August second in French, right? So now, listen to this. Okay, this is Elder Azariah. Okay. He, he, he calls himself Elder Azariah, right? So listen to this. All right, getting the word out at work. Yeah, yeah. You hear that? Getting the word out. Getting the word out at work. Great millstone don't teach that. We don't teach. You know the apostles and elders of Great millstone and the uh, brothers on down. They don't. They don't teach you to go to work and wear your fringes and prophesy at work with your hat on. You know. We speak against that. You know. That's not a wise thing to do. That's how you you get your daily bread. You know. You're not supposed to go to work and prophesy at work. You know, yeah, sometimes, you know, you might, you might, um, you know, speak, you know, a little truth for Jake at work, but you don't actually go in there prophesying against the whole world, speaking about America being destroyed. You don't do that, you know, but this guy clearly, you know, doesn't get it, you know. Like I said, that's the same guy that was in the other video, and I'm going to uh, prove, prove it furthermore. But um, I'm going to skip to around, okay. Around here, right? Listen to what this guy's about to say. All right. Campus safety officer. 
working with the um, um, police department. You hear that? Safety campus officer working with the police department. Now, if you know one thing about uh, Great Millstone, you know, um, you know, we don't, we don't uh, really, in, you know, indulge, indulge with actions with police officers, you know? Like, we, we're not going to have a job to where, you know, we, we, we're not going to want to have a job to where we got to deal with police officers, you know, as far as, you know, uh, uh, you know, giving them information and stuff like that. But, um, it's, you know, he said he works with the police department, you know, and that's a telltale sign, you know, that's um that he really might be an agent, you know, just like Nate, you know, Nate, um, you know, he doesn't teach that uh, the RFID chip is the mark of the beast and he doesn't teach him that the names of Yahweh Bashim Yahshua matter anymore. You know, and that's how we know that he he, he, he sold out, you know, because he used to be a cop. I don't know if he still is, you know, but um, this guy said working uh, with the police department, right? And, um, you know, when you keep watching the video, he he said, um, you know, basically out of most eyes coming back with uh, for elect men like myself, you know, but the way he said it is as if he knows he's going to get saved. You know, I, you know, y'all could go ahead and watch the video for yourselves. But, um, you know, in the video, he, you know, he's he's quoting, uh, you know, he's saying things and, and uh, giving scriptures, but the scriptures that he's given are not actually specific, you know, so like, you know. He says certain things like the most size dealing with the men, right? You could go watch the video for yourself. He said the most size dealing with the men. And he said, um, the um he said, um, read Ezekiel chapter 9 through 37. That means the man <laughs> telling you to go read pretty much 90% of the book. You know? But we don't really do that here in Great Most. I mean, yeah, you know, in the scriptures, you know, um, you know, all you know, all throughout the book, you know, uh, uh, all throughout the six, um, sixty-six books, of uh, the King James and the Apocrypha, you know, yeah, give out judgment against a uh, uh, wicked men of, of you know the two thirds, you know, about you know salvation of the nation of Israel and stuff like that. But you know, we don't, we're not going to tell you to read Ezekiel nine through thirty-seven, you know, and and then one thing he might say, he, he's going to say again is uh, Revelation chapter 2 through to chapter 23 stuff like that you know but you know that that dude he don't sound right man that dude ain't right you know but um right so now you know i, ch I checked out a lot of his different pages right that's one of them right the man of the lord that's the one i just we just came on then he has this one right here right keep in mind he has a great most on page right you go right here that's him again right there with ISUPK. You see? Hold on. I don't know if you can see it clearly. See, that's him right here with ISUPK. You see that? And he's always going to be doing that, man. Sending different agents among camps, having to do some bug out shit and just blame it on us as if we're the violent ones, as if we're the terrorists. Because now Esau's make, uh, uh, putting us as the new face of terrorism. You know, you had a, a couple, um, I think it was you know, about a year, year ago, you had this one guy, you know, that um was on campus, you know, and um he's, um he basically, he I think he stabbed some kids. He stabbed some, some of them um fucking, um, um, people at the at the college, and when they arrested him, they uh, um, they said basically he, you know, they showed his social media and stuff, and basically he was repping Hebrew Israelite. He had the beard, he had the bandana, you know. So Esau's gonna make it, uh, push it out there as if we're the terrorist ones, you know. But um, you can clearly see, you know, that's him right there. I should be kidding. I'm, I'm gonna show you even more more videos. That's the same guy. That's the same dude. Look. That's the same dude with the, with the shades on. You see? ISUPK, right? G he has a GMS page. Now he's in ISUPK, right? That's a GMS page right there that yeah. I just showed y'all, right? And then yeah, he has this video, of rapping, know. you know, Great Millstone and all that. And, he, and, you know, keep in mind, he doesn't even really push three videos a week, you know, like the apostles um, commanded. But, um... You go right here. Now, that's a different camp that he's in again. You see? And that was August 1st. Keep in mind, he posted a video, 
you know, talking about Yahweh Shah, this and that, or oh, I'm August 2nd. But this right here, he, he's an ISUP kid. He's in, he got a GMS page. And this kid right here, he's in the ISOC August the camp, right? That's the same guy right here. Have a, a, a bus travel system. You see? Okay? Be doing a That's the same dude. He clearly, the same voice and everything. And visit Working with the police department. You see? Okay? So we're gonna I'm going to show you. Let me go to this page real quick. Right, see, he has two videos up. on that page. Yes, right? So that now, and that's what, like, a, the third page so, so far. Yeah, about the third, no, the fourth page so far. Because you have this one right here, Hebrew Exodus. To but know, no, understand. Uh, you go right here, that's his fifth page. Uh. Right? Yeah. Uh. Right, yeah, that's him right there. That's him yeah. and his family. True Israelites. Right? That's him right uh. here. You see? Israel in Christ. You see that? Do you see that? Do you see that? That's a damn agent. You see that? Israel united in Christ. So which camp are you in? You got ISOC. You got ISUPK. You, are, you got GMS. You got IUIC. Right? So now that's his fifth page. So now you go to this one. That's the oh, uh, same page again. Oh, my fault. Slack here. I got to go to history. Damn. Okay, yeah. All right, so now that's another page, right? Israel. Army of Israel in August. That was July 22nd. Look at this guy, man. Clearly this dude is an agent. Esau's setting up these men to try, to try to demonize us. Esau's about to make a move on us, man. You already see the brothers down in um, Suriname being persecuted, you know, for the word of the Lord. Look at this. You know? Look at this. Well, oh, that's the same page again. Prophesying at work. The women. Same guy, same dude. Now here's another another that page man's again. Man in charge, being a king. Hebrew king. Well, I prophet. used to be a comic book writer. See? I've been an ebook author. February twentieth, uh, for 2018. you know since two thousand and, and <laughs> look fourteen. Look at this. Another one. Hebrews forever. That's him and his woman. <laughs> him and his. So oh wife. man, if you get Learn to this video, he's talking about his, you know, his children, his, you know, stuff like that. One six. Look, Hebrews forever. You go over here, Ben Yosef. There he go again. Look at him. That's him right here, boasting of being on the news for for running, you know, airless, you know, some bullshit running an airless marathon, you know. You see, Esau's, Esau, Esau's really coming for us. There he go. And keep in mind, I seen a video where he, um, matter of fact, no, we we gonna watch. I'm, I'm gonna say it after. I'm, I'm gonna just show, show you more videos. That's him again. Another another page. Hebrew studies. Come on. That's the same dude. And you don't. He doesn't even go hard like Great Millstone pushing the word word like like the man of Great Millstone. So. You know, there's no reason for him to have all these pages. It's not like he's really getting blocked, you know? Look at this. He's an agent, the Hebrew warrior. Um, you see, that's a different you know, page. That's him again. By the most you go to high. this right here. That's him again. Dr. Dr. Franklin v Victor Beckles. You see that? This right here. That's Telling him and his son. Crap. You see that? You see right here. They'll never give up. That's him right here. You see that? That's him right there. That's the same dude. That's the same exact dude. Hi. That's the agent. Hi there. How Look, are you doing you today? This page, Hebrew Exodus. It's say. him again. You go right here, men of Zion. Him is, again. Is Look at this. Church pastor, Dr. Frank. Dr. Dr. Frank Beckles. Him again. You see, he used to be a pastor because I also Googled him. Uh, his parents were so-called reverends. You know, he he was in the U.S. military. He worked with the Department of Homeland uh, Homeland Homeland Services. When you Google that guy, that name, Doctor Franklin Beckles, you see. So that that guy's clearly an agent. And he himself, in one of the videos, I heard him say that um he started making videos to, since 2016. So how could you be an elder if you only found out about the truth about two years ago? 
You see what I'm trying to say? So Esau is going to make it seem like, you know, we're all the same. You know, we're all terroristic groups, you know? And they, he going he gonna to put it on the news like, you know, he might put this guy on the news. Share you know, make it seem, you know, like we're just a bunch of bug outs. You know, show that, oh, this guy got this t many pages, you know? Or he's with this group, he's with that group yeah, doing this. He used to be a pastor. This. You know how Esau likes to, uh, uh, you know, use his, his words, you know? Same dude, brother Azariah. And that's how he always referred to himself in the videos. Elder Azariah, brother Azariah. You know, another page right Most here again. Same dude, Hebrew Israelite crusader. You see that? March March 14, 2018. We go right here. Hebrew Academy vacation. That's him again right there. Wicked. You see that? And false prophets. And you see that he uses the you know that's the name Yahweh, but um. I seen a video, another video, um, where he used a higher. Look at this. Lost tribes of Israel found. Look, lost tribes of Israel found. Tribe of Benjamin, the Beckles family of Trinidad. That's that's him and his family. Why would you be posting pictures of you and your family? Come on, man. That's him again. You see that? Come on. Hebrew truth. Right. That's him again. And, and when you watch mo most of his, you know, all his videos, really, you know, he doesn't really pull out precepts like that. He, he, um, he might uh, go to a chapter, read, you know, one, you know, couple of verses and all, but he's not connecting precepts like Great Millstone. You know how scriptures say you gotta, you know, um, you know, you gotta edify using precept upon precept, line upon line, here a little and there a little. This guy clearly doesn't do that, you know. Him again, brother Azariah Ben Yosef. You know? That's the same guy. Come on, this guy got his whole history on YouTube. Who who the fuck does that? You know? Come on. That's okay, that's him right oh, he here. That God At I S O C K. You know what I'm trying to say? Either, man. Agents, man. Agents. Come on, man. Victor Beck. Come again. Him and his family. You go right here. Hebrew Israelite family. And come on, bro. Well, how many pages do you need? You ha actually had to sit there and make 48 emails over the last two years. Because I counted, well, you know, from, from what I counted, I counted about 48 pages for that this guy has. So that means you had to make 48 different Gmail accounts in the, in the course of two years to push out these videos. Look, another one. Hebrew Academy. That's him right there. You go right here, Dr. Franklin V. Beckles. That's him. Him and his family again. You see that? Dr. Beckles. Him again. How many pages do you need? Look, Captain Azariah. That's him right there. This is Hebrew Israelite camp leader. All in 2018. Come on, man. Look at this. Officer Azariah Ben Yosef. The ISUPK black bullshit. You know? And that's another thing too, man. We gotta get away from black, man. We gotta get away from that shit. Cause what about the so-called Latinos? You know, you got IUIC and ISUP keep pushing out that black vibration. Nate over here marching, marching against the pro, uh, against violence that the most is bringing upon the two thirds appointed unto death. You know, he's over there marching, talking about oh, black people are in jail, this and that. We're not black people, okay? We're different shades of brown, and we Israelites. We're the twelve tribes of Israel. Look at this guy. ISUPK. But they want to demonize us. Look at this. Look, remnant of a uh, 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 higher. You see? A uh, higher. May 2000, 2018. But he was just using Yahweh. So which one is it? Yahweh or a higher? Which one is it? ISUPK or IUIC? GMS or ISOC? Which one is it? You clearly not part of GMS because we were, you know, the elders would never accept, uh, accept that. I bet the elders don't even know you. You said 2016 started making videos, you know? But um, yeah, man. Clearly see this guy, man. Look, and then you, you, you know, you Google this, this guy, One Body in the Higher. That's how I found most of his pages. See? Ben Yosef again, working Hebrew, man. That's a different page again. You see the same guy gathering in Atlanta. You see? How many pages do you need? How many pages do you really need? Look, gathering in Atlanta, you know, him again, read Hebrews forever, you know, 
Yeah, we watch this Hebrew soldier returns. Say, right, say shalom, again, family. See? Come on, man. Come on. You know? Yeah, you go you go look, look that's him again. Him and his him and his daughter. Okay. You know? And yeah, you're gonna have these My cats come is, um, come up in there, you know. Cool ass Jake, you know, like um I watched a video with uh Yahweh Shah's coming back, the brother Kazak in Mississippi, you know, going in on you know how Jake like to side with the so called white man, man. Come up against us, you know. This guy right here is a sellout, man. Trying to trying trying to trying to uh, uh trying to sell out his own people, you know. But now we're gonna get some some scriptures now. Oh yeah. Let me get this for yeah. Second Corinthians chapter two verse eleven. Lest Satan should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. Yeah, you know, and who's Satan according to the Bible? It's the so called white men, the devil, the Edomites, you know? So we're not ignorant of his devices, you know, and that's one of his devices that he likes to use, you know. Set up uh, uh um you know different uh ter you know, so called uh sleeper cells, you know, send them amongst the, the nation, you know, have you know the do do bug out shit and then um you know try to bring out policies to to you know to further further oppress the people you know like um i know apostle around mentioned it um last week i believe about um this one cat that said um basically how um um basically you can't let crisis go to waste you know how basically you know you gotta you know that's how you bring you know you bring the people more, even more into bondage you know that's how they gonna implement the RFID chip you know scare scare the people scare the people into and and bring and bring in a solution for them you know like I said um I think um he mentioned it about being pressure from above pressure from below to where you you know you're in double straight so now they they you know they they come and bring you that so called salvation you know and then you know that's your ass you know. But um, in the fourth chapter too, yep. And this is Second Corinthians four and one. Therefore, seeing we have this ministry, as we have received mercy, we faint not, but we but have renounced the hidden things of dishonesty, not walking in craftiness, nor hand, nor handling the word of the Most High deceitfully. Yeah, you're not supposed to handle the word deceitfully, you know. Well, hey, hey that guy clearly, you know, he didn't read that scripture. You know, he's a sellout. You know. So he's sending the word of the Most High deceitfully. The Most High is gonna gonna, gonna get guy, guys like that. I I U I C I S U P K and they Satan, you know. Get General again, Hena, you know. All these different different uh, camps that's not even uh, teaching the right doctrine, you know, teaching you that the names don't matter, you know. Not even really prophesying, not for fo focusing on prophecy, you know. Taking breaks for for a couple months, taking break for years, you know. And it says, but by manifestation of truth, commending ourselves to every man's conscience in the sight of the Most High. Yeah, you know, but by manif manifestation of truth. I believe there's one in Galatians 2. Let me see one. Yep, this is Galatians 2 and 4. And that because of false brethren on the ways brought in, who came in privily to spy out our liberty, which we have in the Mashiach, Yahweh Shai, that they might bring us in, in, into bondage. Yeah, you know, and he, you know, that guy's an Israelite, but he's trying to bring us into bondage. He's trying to get Esau to get us, you know. He's getting that check, you know, that they might bring us into bondage. Esau, you know, we already have an example of the apostles, you know, the apostles of GMS, you know, or during 9 11. You know, when they got um arrested for on terroristic charges, you know, and that's the same thing they're about to do. Esau might do a false flag and then you know, you know, blame blame all the so called black Hebrew black Hebrew Israelites. You know, all the black you know, Esau uh uh uh, uh you know, he already had a, a news how um um the black Hebrew Israelites is becoming more militant. You know, they got I showing I C B K with guns and shit. You got I should, I should be getting known for killing trannies and shit, man. You know? Man, come on, man. These guys is go clearly going off. You know, and, uh, it's like, let me get this. These niggas out here killing trannies. Nobody got nothing to say about that. But it's always GMS. GMS is rapist. GMS is this. GMS is that. But what have we done? All we do is read the scriptures and bring our prophecy and read the word, you know? And we're constantly doing it, you know? The mother cats, they could take breaks. They could say anything. Uh, Johanna say you could have sex, uh, uh, anal sex. You know, he teaching about you going to hell, you getting raped by Satan in the, in the butt cheeks, 
You know, nobody else got nothing to say about that. You got guys like Sakari that won awards, you know, nobody got nothing to say about that, you know. But when, when it comes to Great Millstone, everybody coming up against us, you know. You got you got Israel, actual guys that know that they're Israelites siding with Christians and people of the world to come up against against us. You know, that's how you know who, who really have the truth, you know. So, um. This is Psalm 64, I'm going to start at 1. To the chief musician, a psalm of David. Hear my voice, O Yahweh, by Hashim, Yahushua, and my prayer. Preserve my life from fear of the enemy. Hide me from the secret counsel of the wicked, from the insurrection of the workers of iniquity. Yet the secret counsel of the wicked is the Illuminati, you know? Because the wicked, according to the scriptures, is the so-called white man. You know, Job 9 and 24, you know? So the secret counsel of the wicked is the Illuminati, the Melissa, are the so-called white men, the Elise of Esau, the Rothschilds, the Duponts, the Gettys, the Apple Oppenheimers, you know, the 13 uh, uh, families, the 13 families that run the banks, you know, they're the, they're the wicked, you know, and that the, the, their counsel is to what? To bring down the, uh, 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 the nation, to exterminate the nation of Israel, you know. But to do away with uh, uh, with the men of the Lord prophesying about their destruction, you know, because the least they're scared right now. You know, it tells you in Job that a dreadful sound is in his ears. You know, we telling him about what's coming, what was what's gonna come to him, and he actually sees the things that that uh, uh, that we say come come in the past. You know, started with the apostles on down. You know, we tell him about the more more unnatural disasters happening, and it, and you see it more happening more and more. You know, we telling them about them going into World War Three and America being destroyed. You know. And, and and they you know they, they see it come to, they seen it come to pass as well you know they don't have you know they don't have you know they they seen that they're not even in control you know they plan to do they they, they try to do this and it end up going a you know a total opposite way you know no matter what they do is gonna bring it to uh it's gonna bring their own destruction you know so you know now they they losing their minds so what they're gonna try to do is just do away with us you know it tells you that they're gonna come with great wrath you know. They're going to try to uh, 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 spoil and destroy those that fear the Lord, you know. And it says, who wet their tongue like a sword and bend their bows to shoot their arrows, even bitter words, you know. And that's what they do with it, with their media or black Hebrew Israelites. No, we, we never said we were black. We are Hebrew Israelites according to the scriptures, you know. You don't want, you don't want labeling people by color, you know. The most I don't view people by color. He, he classifies you by nation, by your father's lineage. You know, if you're a so-called black Latino and Native American man, you're on your father's side. You're an Israelite, you know, and you also have confusion of faces scattered all throughout the planet Earth. You know, that look like different nations. But if you resonate with this word, you're an Israelite as well. You know, so no, it's not about color, you know, because it's only two different colors of people on the planet Earth. You have brown people, normal people, you know. And you have red people, you know, you have brown from the dark brown to light brown. And then you have uh, red people from a from a dark, juicy red to light pink, you know. So that's your so-called white people, you know. And it says um, that they may shoot in secret at the perfect. Suddenly do they shoot at him and fear not. They encourage themselves in an evil manner. They commune of laying snares privily. And that's one of them snares, you know. The labeling us as terrorists, you know, just so he can uh, move in on us, you know, have the whole world hate us, you know, and these people are so stupid that whatever, you know, Esau, you know, Esau is going to just betray us like, like we the worst thing going and they and these people won't believe it. Many of our people, our people is going to be the main ones to come up against us, you know, and it says, um, and they say, who shall see them? They said, uh, they search out iniquity, the, the iniquities, they accomplish a diligent search both the end with thought of every one of them and the heart is deep yeah their heart is deep you know that's why scriptures say how are the things of esau searched out how is hidden things sought up you know because this devil man people don't even know don't people don't even know who the real kings of this earth are you know the 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 the, the families of, of of the of the banks the bankers you know they don't even know about that you know they don't even know that these elites they put a number they uh, 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 on on the whole world, you know, by 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 changing history and all that, you know, they don't even know about that, you know, they don't even know that they're trying to establish a new world order, you know, these people are stupid, man, you know, but um, let me see, do I have anything else? Uh, no, I'm thinking, yeah, I had something else, but I can't remember it right now. Damn, I'm stuck. I'm trying to see. 
What else can I get? Matter of fact, yeah, let me get to Luke 21. Hold on. You know, because Yahweh Shah also prophesied of these things, you know. The times that we're in, we're in the times of prophecy, you know. So, matter of fact, yeah, this is right here. This is Luke 21. Uh, matter of fact, uh, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm going to start at 9. And it says, But when you shall hear of wars and commotions, be not terrified, for these things must first come to pass, but the end is not by and by. And you see it happening, you know, all these different nations gearing up for World War Three. All these different nations are, are buying up different um, nuclear arsenals. You know, all these different nations threatening each, threatening each other. You know, all these different nations telling their people to prepare for World War Three. You know, and this is actual current news. You know, but majority of people don't even know that's going on. You know, you got the trade war going on between, uh, 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 you know, America and these different European nations and, and with China and all that. People don't even realize that that's going to lead to lead to World War Three. You know, there's always been a, a, a trade war before or trade wars lead to world wars, you know, and it says. Um, it says, then said, said he unto them, nation shall rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom. And so that's what we see going on right now. You know, it says, and great earthquakes shall be in diverse places and famines and, and pestilences and fearful sight and great signs shall there be from heaven. Yeah, and you see, you see these hap these things happening. You know, um, the other Nazar Akkad mentioned how, you know, he had an earthquake app on his phone and he said he had to delete it because, you know, he was constantly getting earthquake, uh, earthquake notifications, you know, every hour, you know, and I had one on my phone too. Now, you know, I don't, I don't even have it anymore, but it said last year was last year, 2017. It was over 2,200 earthquakes last year. It was nine hurricanes back to back, which, uh, Harvey was one of them that, that, that fucked up, uh, Texas down there, you know? You, know, you see all these different um, so-called natural disasters, but they're really unnatural, you know. But it says great signs that they be from heaven. You see all these different eclipse, eclipses going on. You, know, you just had a, 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 a blood moon, you know, not that long ago, about a week or two ago. Now you got another, you got, a, you got a, a solar eclipse coming this month, you know. I think of August, August 11th, there's a, there's another eclipse coming, a solar eclipse. I, I, you know that, yo, man, we, this is the time that we're in, man, the time of the end, you know? And it says, but therefore all these, before, but before all these, they shall lay their hands on you and persecute you, delivering you up to the synagogues and into prisons, being but brought before kings and rulers for my name's sake. Yeah, because, you know, they're demonizing us now, and that's going to lead to actually to, to them actually uh, lay, putting hands on us, you know, leading us into concentration camps, you know. Uh, 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 you know, we're going to jail, federal, state prison, you know. You might, might get tortured or, or something, you know, and then, you know, bring you to, you know, bring you to court. Before the judge, you know, have you on, on on national TV as a terrorist, you know, or you know, asking you about your beliefs. Also, you you believe that, you know, white people are gonna be exterminated. You against America, America is gonna be destroyed. Also, are you saying that only black people could be saved? You know, stuff like that. That's what they're gonna be doing. You know, and people are gonna actually uh, come up, really come up against us because they don't understand the whole message that we're, we're speaking of. You know, they don't understand that we're standing up for righteousness. You know. It tells you in the scriptures that everyone that is godly in a Mashiach shall suffer persecution. You know, and then there's another one that says that, um, um, you know, basically we're going to suffer persecution because we trust in a true living God. You know, and that's what all the prophets of old always, this will happen to them. You know, it, it wasn't, you know, they were, they were, they, they were in love, you know, that's why these people are deceived, man. They don't know, they don't know what's going on. They don't know the Bible, you know. And it says, um, and it shall turn to you for a testimony. Settle it therefore, and tell, settle it therefore in your hearts not to meditate before, but ye shall answer. For I will give you a mouth and wisdom which all your adversaries shall not be able to gainsay nor resist. You know, so yeah, that's what's gonna happen. You know, just like all the disciples of old. You know, they trusted in the Lord, and the Lord put that word, the, His words, in, in their mouths, and and they cut the people. You know, because we, we're just coming out the Bible. You know, that's why, you know, you know, I'm taking heed even even more and more, you know, like Elder Yashua would put it. He said, you know, basically, yeah, you know, just come out the scriptures, you know, don't, 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 rent, you know, don't go, you know, don't curse, curse, you know, really curse people out like, you know, out of your own heart. You know, just bring out what the scriptures say, you know, bring out what the scriptures say, because they, they could say anything 
about us, but it's not our message. It's what the, the book says. You know, they all claim to believe in it. So let's see what 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 you believe in says, you know. But um, it says, um, and ye shall be betrayed both by parents and brethren and kinsfolk and friends. And some of you shall they cause to be put to death. Yeah, that's going to happen soon, you know. They going when they, our families see us on the news and all that. You know, they might have, you know, uh, have us as the most wanted FBI li uh, on the FBI list, or they looking for this person, that person. They, they they get a phone call on you, your own family, you know, and deliver you up unto them, you know. Talking about yeah, he's always been on that Israelite stuff. I knew, you know, stuff like that, you know. It might be, you know, uh, you know, World War Three going on, famine going on, and they they ask for information for for you know for. For that, brother, you know, if you want some rations and your whole family deliver you up, you know, and it says, and you shall be hated of all men for my name's sake, you know, and that's how you know who the, the Lord is dealing with, because nobody hate them Christians, you know, nobody hate them Christians, you know, and you, and you see amongst Israel, great millstone is the most hated camp. So we're the men of the Lord, you know, no matter what the fuck you say, you know, the proof is in the pudding, you know, and, um, but yeah, um, yeah, that was pretty much it, yo. Yeah, so, you know, with that.